Wave TV, Cass. Well, um, buzzing still, mate. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, when that first goal went in, I was rattled. I was rattled. I thought the first goal was gonna be really, really important. Um, turned out not to be, and I think to be fair, like, um, they had a good start, they had a good spell, but I feel like I feel like the game was well controlled. I feel like the game was well controlled, man. Um, and credit to Arteta, man, because tactics are doing everything at the moment, so this guy, we've got a guy in Mikel Arteta that, you know, a lot of people have spoken about the fact that, you know, he's quite a he's disciplinarian, doesn't mess about, but what a lot of people are not talking about is tactically. He's now done it to Man City yep. and to Chelsea in the fight, he even did it to Liverpool. Yep. His so tactics are spot on. 100%. I'm like, now we've got to put some respect in Arteta's name. Like when he first came to the club, there were a lot of people saying, oh, he's, you know, he's a Pep Guardiola's cone boy, all this kind of stuff. But he's, he's proven it now. He's turned this club around from how he's talking about the club. I mean, as Arsenal fans, we didn't really look at Arteta as a legend as an Arsenal legend, even though he was the captain. But from that first press conference, the way he was talking about the club, we're like, hang on a minute. You're talking about this club like a legend. And all of a sudden, he's talking that big club mentality. And you can see he's getting the absolute most out of these players. So we, we've got to put some respect on his name now. Respect, I'm sure respect is going to, I mean, this thing about cones and that, he's dispelled that in eight months, isn't he? 100%, man, 100%. I think he's someone, um, from a growth point of view, I think everybody was calling for more experienced heads yeah. and whatnot. I think there's something about a, new, a fresh new manager with a philosophy that's, I suppose, looking at some of the great people that he's worked with and all of the rest of it. I think, I, think we've got, I think we've got something good here. So I feel like he'll take us far. I don't know, I don't know if he's the man that will time to tell, if he will take us to glory, but he will take next steps wise. I think he's definitely the guy, man. And I think he's showing that. Got to back him though, aren't they? 100%, 100%. I mean, what he's done, he's already surpassed Emery. For, he's got European football the same way Emery did, although we know we should have got Champions League football last season with the games that we had remaining, but he's got us a trophy. And for me, that tells us all we need to know about Arteta. Look at the run that we had. Leeds, look at how they were dominating the championship. Bournemouth away, Sheffield United away, Man City, and then Chelsea in the final. I mean, he's, he's proven. Also, you've got to look at the fact that it's not seven months just as Arsenal manager. It's seven months as a manager, period. And I think, I think that kind of goes without saying. I think it's great for his CV. I think it's great that he's done what he can to prove to the guys upstairs um, that, that look, if, if you invest in me, imagine what I can do. So with, what, with the resources that you've got, with the tools that you've given me, the very blunt tools that you've given me, this is what I've been able to achieve. I think if you give me a little bit more, I think if we all think if we give him a little bit more, a little bit back in, we can go far, man. And a great start for that finally would be signing Aubameyang. 100%. I mean, you just need to look at Aubameyang's celebration when he's about to lift that trophy, you can see how happy he is. For me, all the, the, the sounds I've been hearing out of the club, it looks positive. Arteta's talking like, you know, he wants to stay. For me, there's nowhere else where he needs to be. I think, I think he's going to sign. Robbie here from AFTV. We just got to say a big thank you to everybody who follows us across our various channels. Over a million followers on YouTube. Don't forget, you can now also catch us on Reddit. We're on Reddit, so get involved with us on Reddit and also on TikTok. Keep it AFTV, baby, right here.